colors already. So I don't know which one I want. This orange is cute though. <coughs> I think I might just wear the one that's in my purse. So yeah, it's been like since the wedding since I actually had a, a freaking pedicure. This, again, my life is just so hectic, so I'm gonna finally enjoy this relaxation. Oh, oh it is perfect. So, make sure my toes don't be wet. So, here's the colors that I actually have in my bag. Hey, y'all. So, I just left the nail shop. Um, Filling my color. I got a. I chose the little peach, not peach. It's like a reddish pink kind of like. So, can't really see because of the color, but it's like a reddish peach. It's really pretty. So, yeah, ended up getting that on my toes too. But now I am going to buckle up my seatbelt first and then I'm gonna um, get ready to run to the theater actually no I'm gonna get me something to eat because I'm hungry I'm trying not to mess up my nails give me something to eat because I'm hungry I gotta pull it I'm gonna mess them up anyway cuz I definitely just did but I'm gonna give me something to eat I don't know what yet and then I am, then I am going to run to the theater so I can grab our tickets for the perfect guy for later on this evening. And yeah, that'll pretty much be it. Hubs is at work right now. He doesn't get off until 1 p.m which is not bad that's only another hour and a half so okay, so i just came all the way up here to the movie theater so that i can get our tickets and our seats to the show for later on today i don't want to have to be waiting in line nor do i want to have to fight anybody over two seats so i came to the studio movie grill which is where we went um, I think it was Thursday we went to see the visit where we can come up here and choose our seats and where we sit so that way when we come nobody's sitting in our dang on seat so I'm going to go up in there get these tickets come on out go about my way I had some uh, taco cabana for lunch it was just like a little quick um, Mexican patio cafe that we have here I went through the drive-thru. I didn't sit inside. I should have because then I could have got a margarita. But, um, yeah, I just had some breakfast tacos, which was just like a potato and egg. And then I had a, um, a bacon and potato taco. Yeah, it sounds really weird, but I swear it's so good. So, um, yeah, I'm going to run up in here, get these tickets. Actually, um, I need to pull up the information so that I can get them. So this theater they have like a, a Groupon where you can get um, in the theater for five bucks uh, so yeah I like that we always come here we always get some tickets for them so 
let me just make sure I can pull it up I'm really feeling this nail color it's really pretty when I try to choose nail colors I try to choose them according to the the season so this is not really it's summerish but it's also like fallish so I could kind of like get away with it it's I'm in Houston so it's gonna seem to be hot all year round so uh, I'm just trying to pull up my Groupons if they still work this thing is like taking all day oh, come on these definitely expired but anyway so I'm just gonna buy two more because babes was supposed to give me his information for his Groupon because he has two Groupons on his but of course he does not remember his password and I tried to figure it out but I don't know what it is so I'm just going to purchase two more tickets we can always use his tickets anytime to go see any other movie so I'm just going to purchase two more tickets and let me get two is that the right one movie city center so I'm just going to purchase two more tickets and um Dang it. I could have sworn. Now they want me to. Oh, I did update it. So, hopefully, they let me purchase them because I always buy them. Great. They let me purchase them. So, I'm going to get ready and head out. This is where we go to the theater at. See if you can see it. And lock the doors so I got a really good park like right here just a little theater it's like a big parking lot nothing too special and we go to the theater and yeah my battery's getting ready to die there's the studio movie grill. I like this little scenery because they have all type of stuff that um, you can do. But then there's a restaurant that we went to. It was called um, Texas Day Brazil. This is Steakhouse. It was really good. But I mean, so let me get ready and purchase these tickets. So how about I get all the way up in there? And obviously, everybody has the same idea as me. Let's purchase our tickets early so that we ain't got to wait. So, yeah. I am going to see if I can get, to the, get tickets at the theater that's next door to us so I don't have to. Man, I'm just so mad because... I really thought I was getting ahead. So I'm going to have to see if I can purchase some tickets closer to the theater that's closer to us. But I, the only thing I just, like I said, I hate getting tickets from other places because they don't allow you to choose your seating. And I like to be able to choose my seats. So, um, I guess we have to resort to something else, which I don't want to because I really want to go here. I mean, like, they check all the show times from 1.45 p.m. show all the way up until the last show. Clearly, everybody had the same idea as me. They bought tickets probably yesterday. Ugh. So, I guess I should have did that yesterday and I would have had some good seats. And the only seats they had good, I mean, the only top show time they had good seats in was, like, the, the 2.45 I'm not going to make the 245 show. It's like 12 o'clock right now. So, I guess I'll have to look at the one closer to us. Which is not a problem. I just don't like fighting people over seats. But that means we're going to have to get there like an hour early just to get a good freaking seat. So, 
And this is why I do not like going to the show when stuff first come out because this very reason. Everybody and their grandmama, granddaddy, grandpa, granddaddy and grandpa is the same, but their cousin and their baby and little Kiki them is always up in there. So. Be walking with one of them if you don't stop fucking with me. <laughs> Damn good. I'm just gonna have to crap it. Finally, about to go and see a perfect guy. <sighs> say hey. I said say hey. It's for horses. <sighs> it's just so difficult. But we're here. I got a little glare. I told y'all, I hope it lives up to the height. If not, I'm be pretty livid. One of them skipped the box office. We're going straight through the door because we want to get, we already got our tickets. Here, Either we early. Both. <laughs> that was actually good. It actually lived up to the hype. You don't think so? It was good. It it, it wasn't as yeah. It wasn't like I thought it would be, but it was alright. And it wasn't really even crowded, but I give it probably like a four and a half stars because it don't really get that that other half of the fifth one. But it was good. You know how you watch the movie and it just makes you feel like like when somebody fighting, especially a woman and she find a man, you just wanna just take over like <laughs> right. that's right. how it yeah, was man. shit me I I'm sorry <laughs> uh uh that's a good idea though so to have a whole the house set up like you're gonna provoke somebody you need to have a house set up ready for them when they come in go buy me a 12 gauge right with the first two shots maybe just one but you need the first two Third time's the charm. You provoke me again, then you get popped up. You get one with me. Shame on you. I don't do three strikes. So, yeah. The movie wasn't that crowded. Like, I guess it's because we was in, like, a, um, I guess, like, a, a stadium theater, but it was cool. <sighs> It's like a scorching. 